So far, for the last 80 years, nuclear weapons have not been used to kill people. It, but, you know, people, powerful countries, including this country, my country, Russia, and many other countries, have studied this problem over the years. China, the United States, and yeah, Russia especially, can definitely start talking. And hopefully they will, but it will only happen, in my opinion, if the people of the world realize the unbelievable danger and demand in some way, or request from their governments, whose leaders know exactly how dangerous it is. It's always been a hope of scientists with the international connections that they could serve as a bridge between different countries, it's called scientific diplomacy, it's scientific culture. We treasure disagreements, arguments, competition between ideas where the judge is nature and not power or force or superstition. Now, science is universal. The laws of science, of physics, apply everywhere in the universe, not to speak of the Earth. We all are asking the same questions, and we benefit enormously from collaboration, cooperation, discussion. So the increasing attempts to isolate people because of industrial secrets and military conflicts is very detrimental to the development of science and of course to the international harmony. <laughs>